Any design that can be opened in FineLine software can be resized with or without changing the stitch count for the new size. Select the design by clicking on it or select it from the sequence view. Note the stitch count at the top left of the workspace. Place the cursor over any outside corner and when the cursor appears as a double head arrow press and hold the left mouse button and roll the mouse. You can reduce or enlarge the design depending on the direction that you roll the mouse. The current design size is always displayed in real time at the bottom left of the workspace. When the desired size is reached, release the mouse button. Check the design stitch count again. If the design was enlarged, the stitch count has increased. If the design was reduced, the stitch count has decreased. To resize a design disproportionately, place the cursor over one of the interior handles. When the cursor appears as a double head arrow, press and hold the left mouse button and roll the mouse. When the desired effect is achieved, release the mouse. Another resizing method is to type in numerical values for the new size. Select the design and click on the transform icon in the properties box. Type the desired height or width and click apply. To resize disproportionately, uncheck the box labeled maintain aspect ratio and type in the desired height, width, or both. This is a handy feature when you'll use a series of designs that you want to appear similar in size, such as quilt squares. On rare occasion, certain users may need to resize a design without recalculating the stitches. To do this, select the design and click the transform icon in the properties box. Uncheck the box labeled regenerate stitches. Type in a new size and press the Enter key. The design is resized to the new dimension and the stitch count remains unchanged. Remember that you normally want to regenerate stitches to be appropriate for the new size.